forget. You know where I'm at, you know where I've been. You understand that life started out living. Fuck with nothing less than on the 10. Ask me, do I love you, baby? You depend. Rich new will, yeah. I'm that nigga still. You want something real, yeah. But if I make you feel, remember when I used to kiss you on your forehead? Fuck all that talking, baby, give me more head. We gon' fuck from tonight to the morning. We gon' fuck from tonight to the morning. She looking at me, I'm looking at her. We digging the same. We digging the same. Come fuck with the kid, I know what you want, I know why you can. You can't get over me, you think I'm right where you supposed to be. Everybody seem to notice me. I don't fuck with niggas, can't get a hold of me. I'm a king, bitch, hold the door for me. Focus on the future, I'm on the future. I put the past in the car. You better be lucky we talk. Don't come to me here till I'm not. She gon' do whatever to keep this. She a bad little freak, bitch. Give it to me when I need it. My heart on my sleeve, I'm bleeding. 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 Hello? Hey, I just came home from the bed. She's still in love with the kid. She already know what it is. I guess she ever forget. You know where I'm at. You know where I've been. You understand that life started out living. Fuck with nothing less than on the ten. Ask me, do I love you, baby? You depend. Rich new will, yeah. I'm that nigga still. You want something real, yeah. But if I make you feel, remember when I used to kiss you on your forehead? Fuck all that talking, baby. Give me more head. We gon' fuck from tonight to the morning. We gon' fuck from tonight to the morning. She looking at me. I'm looking at her. We digging the same. We digging the same. Come fuck with the kid. I know what you want. I know why you can. You can't get over me. You think I'm right where you supposed to be? Everybody seem to notice me. I don't fuck with niggas. Can't get a hold of me. I'm a king, bitch. Hold the door for me. For me. Focus on the future, I'm on the future. I put the past in the car. You better be lucky we talk. Don't come to me here till I'm not. She gon' do whatever to keep this. She a bad little freak, bitch. Give it to me when I need it. My heart on my sleeve, I'm bleeding. 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 Never met one like me, that was no surprise. Was no surprise. Heard you moving sideways, let me get you in line. Mm-hmm. I ain't tryna steal your heart, I'm not your Valentine. Not your Valentine. The way I come with all these gifts, you think it's Christmas time. Yeah, Whole world fun. full of sin, uh-huh. shit get wicked sometimes. Yeah. You want a flying piece, it costs you a ticket sometimes. Yeah. When I speak, it's quiet, yeah. you hear cricket sometimes. <laughs> if you learn from my mistakes, then you listen next time. Yeah. She know I'm top tier. You know I'm top tier. She know not to talk when the cops here. Talk when the she cops. know I miss her more when she not here. She not here. I talk to God a lot and keep my thoughts they clear. Keep my head in line. A lot of niggas switched up on me. Guess it's life. I guess it's I life. my brother was my enemy in plain sight. In plain I sight. dream at night, but in the daytime we live in life. Daytime. Live in the moment, cause we'll never get to night twice. I will never get I it. can't sell my soul, a soul can't pay the right can't price. The right Don't price. turn your back on me and yeah, make my shoulder cold as ice. Cold you as know ice. I never mean you're wrong, I always treat you I right. Treat you Hopped right. in the streets early, made it home every night. Home every Be scared night. to fly sometimes, pray to God for safe flights. Same New you since Toy Story, we was close like Woody and Buzz like. Mm-hmm. I put my life inside a book, I got my paper right. Got my paper right. If it's love, it's off the strip, it ain't no favor it right. Ain't no favors right. Yeah. She ain't never met one like me, that was no surprise. Was no surprise. Heard you moving sideways, let me get you in line. Mm-hmm. I ain't trying to steal your heart, I'm not your Valentine. Not your Valentine. The way I come with all these gifts, you think it's Christmas yeah, time. It's Whole cynical. world full of sin, mm-hmm. shit get wicked sometimes. Yeah. You want a flying piece, it costs you a ticket sometimes. Yeah. When I speak, it's quiet, yeah. you hear crickets sometimes. Hear sometimes. If you learn from my mistakes, then you listen next time. Yeah. Long live old me. All right, hold on one sec.
All right. All right, y'all. Uh hopefully y'all weekend went well. Um we got some things to go over today. Uh and I'm gonna show y'all as I go over them so y'all can know I ain't lying to you. Um hold on one sec. All right. Now, this uh this cat rapper, um I've been exposed to him a while ago. He been lying the whole time claiming um how can I say claiming I'm lying and his stuff is real and this and that. And uh he just put out a music video. And this right here was the last straw. This the dagger on the cake. I'm saying this is like, how can I put it? Like he can't come back from this. This is undeniable evidence. He faked his views. Now, let me pull this up for y'all. Hold on, let me add this to the screen. Hold on, let me see which one I'm gonna put on here. Hold on. All right, I had to make sure that was all fixed for y'all. All right, so boom. If you look right here, right? He has about 180 views on this video. Now, this right here is undeniable. He has 180 views on this video one hour after dropping it. So that means that he put this video out and 180 people saw it in one hour. Now, let's slide over, right? Ain't nothing wrong with that. Got eight comments. What does that say right there? At 18 hours, this man had a thousand views. Ain't nothing wrong with that. I ain't saying nothing wrong with that. Everything peaches and cream, right? If you slide over, hold on now. Y'all see 20 comments, 52 likes, 1K, right? Slide over. What does that say? 2,000 views in 22 hours. He just went from 1,000 views in 18 hours to 2,000 views in 22 hours. So you're telling me it took him 18 hours to get 1,000 views, and all of a sudden, in a four hour span, he collects another thousand views. Now, that's not just it, because it gets worse. You swipe over again. Two hours later, within one day, he's at 2.6K views. So, with just within a few hours, he jumped at 18 hours from 1K. Up to 2.6K, 1.6K views in just a few hours. Now, some of y'all might be saying, well, he may have gotten that. How do you know? You can't you can't say he faked this stuff. Like you gotta you gotta have more than that. Come on, man. You're just hating. That's what they're gonna say. So let me show you what I'm talking about, right? You ready? It says. He has 2.6K views in one day with 25 comments. How the hell can it say that when... Hold on, hold on. Where is it? Where is it? Let me slide over. Bow. What does that say, y'all? What does that say? I just showed y'all that it said 2.6K views. In one day, how in the world, in the world, would it say 1.3K in one day if it already was at 2.6K, it was already at 2K in 22 hours? You telling me YouTube is counting views backwards? How did he go from 2,000 
at 22 hours to 1.3K in one day. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. 2.6K <laughs> in one day. He had 2.6K views. Right when I caught it is where he cheated the views. 18 hours, 1,000 views. That was his real views in a day. Trash. Trash. He been rapping in Erie for how long? He's still only doing 1,000 views in first day? And the only reason he got that was because of the girls in the video. Everybody was talking about how they was weak and this and that. And his mom tried to hype him up, talk about, I'm getting you for defamation. You always lying on his name. You always this and that. Guess what? His mom is his music manager, meaning that he has something to do with putting this out. If she's his management, right? They got some signed papers, allegedly. So she knows about the lies. So she's a part of it as well because she's managing it according to her. You feel what I'm saying? Make this make sense. How did he get 2.6K views? And currently right now, 1.3K in a day. Make that make sense. Make this make sense. Matter of fact, hold on now. Just to put the... Just, just to really show y'all what I mean. Just to show y'all how real this is. Hold on. People really do this, y'all. That's why I say you got to watch for people. If, if, if I won here, who is going to expose to you these lying rappers that they don't got? Trying to act like... Listen, I could drop a video right now. No promo, no nothing. It's going to do better than 1K in a day. Come on now. This is this man's allegedly life. Like, this is what he wants to do. He's not making nothing off of this man. Nothing. He's trying to cab his mind fake jury, making it look like he's some and ain't. You know what I'm saying? Now, I'm going to prove this to y'all. Hold on. Let me show y'all this real quick. Hold on. Let me pull this up for y'all. All right, so remove this. I'm gonna share my screen for y'all. All right, y'all, boom. I just showed y'all all that evidence, right? I just showed y'all all that evidence, right? Now, why is it two days and he's at 1.4K right now? Hey, Park Zeus, you know why this nigga at 1.4K in a day? How did he go from 2.6K down to 1.4 in two days? When the hell did they start erasing views? Oh, he didn't know YouTube updated they shit. You're not faking views that easy, buddy. Mm -mm. YouTube catch any fake views. They're removing it. They're removing it. Take notes from kill on them, man. Just get you some real, just get you some real clout and people going to watch you for real. You know what I'm saying? You ain't never seen Kale Lono try to fake a Facebook view, try to come on here and fake a view to try to get y'all to watch me. Now, what does this say? If he went this hard to lie to y'all, because I want to teach y'all something. You can't just get a fake view. You can't just like press a button and get a fake view. He paid somebody or did something with somebody to try to get him some fake views. I never seen it be done for free. People do this when they cannot afford real promotion. So the fact that he went and bought the fake chain, his mama made a whole status about it, talking about all this stuff, trying to talk about he's a real artist and this and that. It's not adding up. They're trying to fake this reality. And this is what social media is doing. He goes to sleep wondering why he can't get 2.6 K views. So he had to fake it. And that just shows he ain't got no money. He, they is hurting over there. 
ain't no way you just fake them views when you could have paid real promotion and got you some views. Like he could have really paid for ads. He could have really paid for somebody to put him on a drone and got authentic views. Why embarrass himself? Because he thought he was going to get over on y'all. But guess who was here? Your boy to catch this cat rapping. I said this cat rapping, this cat rapper. I'm a ghostbuster. You feel what I'm saying? These cat rappers keep trying to manipulate y'all, make y'all think they something they not. This is another one. You've already seen Hunted Band. You've already seen a whole bunch of other artists get caught doing this. If they showing all this money or claim they got any type of money, why would they be so cheap on promoting their stuff and try to pay somebody $20, $50 or something for some views? You know what I'm saying? It don't make no sense. I'm telling you, a lot of people, they be fighting depression out here. And in order to fight that depression, they have to keep posting, hoping to get some type of, you know, dopamine feeling like they want people to say something about them. Like, and that's what that little boy wants. He wants to be from the streets and he's not from the streets. He wants to be tough and he's not tough. He wants to be a celebrity, but he's not a celebrity. He wants to have that image of being a street nigga who sells drugs and, and has real jury, but that's not him. You don't have money to buy that. Your music's not good enough to get there. It's not. That's why nobody's paying you to come anywhere. Tell me when somebody in Erie give him 1K or better, 1,000 or better to be anywhere. Anywhere. He can't tell you. He gonna tell you some lame story of, oh, I was in another state and I had a sold out show. Get your lying ass out of here. We can't believe nothing. You say nothing. Capped about the jury. Capped about his views. Come on, man. I done told y'all, man. We got these artificial, genetically modified street niggas out here. Genetically modified street niggas out here. They look like street niggas. They trying to rap like street niggas. They trying to have chains on like street niggas. They trying to have a dreads and a like street niggas. The tattoos so they could fake you. Trying to make you believe that they once had a career. His career never started, y'all. He can't call himself no rapper. His career ain't never even started. He can't even bust 2.5K views in a day. In a day. It's 2024. He's paying for music videos and can't crack 1500 views in a day you have 1.4k in two days yeah the only people who are watching your stuff is your cousins and friends that's it so you your mama whoever else was behind y'all trying to throw dirt on my name y'all got to do better tell your manager she has to do better alleged manager which you all not a real manager she's just your mama and she got the paper and said she's your manager and obviously don't know what she's doing but tell her she can go get some google ads or anything like that and y'all could try to pay for promo like y'all not hurting that much that y'all can't afford 50 to 100 dollars in real promo like can't be hurting that much right but i actually think they are you know what I'm saying? Well, they can't be hearing that much because, I mean, he had to spend at least $50 on the Amazon chain, right? Like, because he didn't get that from no reputable jeweler. It's not no, I mean, it's not VVs up in there. You feel what I'm saying? He dropped the chain. Somebody picked up the chain. I don't know if they went and tried to pawn it or whatever, but they said that shit was cat. In real life, he really, he really wore this chain. Hold on. He really wore this chain in real life. Somewhere. I don't know where he wore it. Look at this. Look at this. Look at that genetically modified mother. Whoa. Look at that. He dreams to be a street nigga. He went and got, he even got his neck tatted. You feel what I'm saying? He even got his arms tatted. You would think, oh, Cuz was in the game. Cuz was downstate. Cuz was in the fed. Never look at his chain. He tried to manipulate him so bad. Oh my gosh, look at the cubic zirconia. Look at the glitter. God damn. Ain't no way he was going through it that much. Or they ain't loving him that much at home. That look at the watch. Oh my gosh, look at the watch. Look at the watch. Bust down glitter. 
Look at the watch, man. Bust down. Look at the teeth. You can't even see the lines between his teeth. That's supposed to be a grill. It's like he's not even getting stuff that looks real. Look at the grill. Tell, where you see a diamond? Where you even see the split between the teeth? Only split you might see is the middle, and I don't know if that's a split. Who did this? But they thought you were this that slow that they would get by on you. They even went and got the chain, the, the watch, the mouthpiece, the glasses, the rings, and they even went and got the views. But you two wasn't playing that. And neither are we over here at what the fuck going on TV. You're not going to just do that to us. You're not going to keep faking us, Mr. Amari. You're going to go wait and save up and go get you a job or something. And I wouldn't recommend it. you going to try to buy some jewelry. I think you should just go work a job or go to school. But don't let them think that you're going to keep trying to be a rapper because all it looked like to us you trying to do is just sell out. That's what it looked like. It looked like you can't wait for somebody in a suit to come say, hey, man, I'll give you five million dollars. You want to wear some nails or hey, man, I want you get what I'm saying. Look like he cannot wait for his moment to get. On. He would be the one celebrity that would really like you feel what I'm saying. If he had his moment. Oh, my gosh. He's going to do whatever for the fame. He seems like he will do whatever for fame. And this is sad. This is sad because nobody looks at you like that. But you you feel what I'm saying. You're caught red handed. You feel like <laughs> this thing is caught red handed. Now, with that being said, y'all, let me just zoom down real quick to remind y'all. To remind y'all where we came from with this. If you came on here late, Mr. Amari Boykin, a.k.a. Dob Deep, got caught faking his views. At one day ago, it said he had 2.6K views. And today, two days, which is now two days, it's suddenly at 1.4K. And YouTube took his views back because the algorithm or however they got it detected that them views were not authentic. And they don't play that. You know what I'm saying? But with that being said, y'all, we got another one. Hold on. All right. So with that being said, y'all, we have... A uh, real life bunny. All right. Uh, I talked about this a little bit on Facebook the other day. Uh, so it, it's come to my understanding that real life funny is in his feelings. Um, he wants to have a sob story. He wants people to feel bad for him. And he's trying to play this role like everybody's against him. Right. And specifically the black community. So with that being said, you already know what type of time he going to be on. He already feel like the black community is against him. So guess what community he going to run over to? Guess what community he going to for validation? You feel what I'm saying? Guess where he going to go for validation? You know what I'm saying? So people like expose themselves with the way that they feel. But at the end of the day, no matter how anybody feels about Kaylon or what the fuck going on TV, you got all these different alleged podcasts or people trying to be a comedian or business, whatever, in Erie. And Kaylono made his own name. You do not see these people sharing Kaylono stuff as in support because Kaylono never needed it. They don't feel like my fan base or whatever is low enough for me to need it. He needs that for validation. I don't have to repost what somebody else posted to mine and say, hey, they reposted me. I made it. You feel what I'm saying? Like, I have real proof of real life funny commenting under my video saying i finally made it once he commented under my post so that's how what the fuck going on tv made him feel once we reported on him he felt like he made it so you see how what the fuck going on tv is validating other people we're not expecting to get validated by someone else because i've already proved myself to be able to have a educational opinion or you feel what i'm saying uh how can i say like any topic that goes on you can trust that Kaylano has a reasonable opinion on this situation. He has not earned that. He's only known for trying to make you laugh, not educating you, not helping you in life, just attempting to making you laugh. And most of the times pissing you off because you are upset of how corny that joke was. You feel what I'm saying? Now, with that being said, I have no issue with this guy. He's just like a bunch of other people I've already seen, you know, in this social media world. They try to go against you immediately and act as if you wasn't supportive and they try to play that victim role. I'm not here to play the victim role. 
if anybody could play the victim role, it should be me. But I'm not going to do that. I don't got to sit here and say, oh, my gosh, all these people are going against me. You feel what I'm saying? He trying to make this excuse. I'm not about to make that excuse. You feel what I'm saying? Because life is life. <laughs> you want you want somebody to sit here and cry for you and be like, oh, my gosh, why are they? You was a grown man. Just like you want to force us to watch them corny jokes, you going to receive the opinions from the people of what you put out now. Like I told this person I spoke to, I'm, I'm about two inches away from making reels and doing skits and, and then it's really going to be a problem. Then they really going to try to say I went and stole somebody lane. I'm trying to stay in my own lane because I could take a lane if I want to. You feel what I'm saying? But that's not me. I'm not here to try to roll on the ground for views or nothing like that. You feel what I'm saying? I just come here and do me and y'all y'all watch me. I appreciate y'all. But this is people's main source that they're trying to do. You feel what I'm saying? Some people mistaken me for this being my main source, but it's not like at all. You feel what I'm saying? Like, this is not something that I take serious enough to say, this is going to be the thing that I'm going to do. Now, I want to say that. Yes, I want this to be a, a very, very serious thing for me, but it's not. I do this as a favor for the people to keep them informed. So if if John John just told on Jimmy around the corner or if somebody got exposed or this person is uh, uh killing people or however, what the fuck going on TV? It says exactly what we're going to talk about. What the fuck going on? You feel what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, they're going to try to paint this picture and you know who lost? When they try to twist this narrative of you being a bad person. Out of all this stuff, I never try to twist this narrative of you are a bad person. I'm talking specifically about this situation going on. They try to twist it and say, he's tearing the community down and he is yet there is no evidence of this. You feel what I'm saying? If anything, I've made people start to think about their actions before they do them. Now people are scared to post certain things because they say, hey, hold on. Is people going to look at me in the right way or the wrong way if I post this? Instead of saying, oh, I'm going to just post uh, shaking my ass everywhere and and just just because I feel like it and I love it. You feel what I'm saying? Now they questioning. Oh, you might end up on Keolano page. Hey, if you that's a good thing that people are questioning doing wrong because they don't want to go up there. You feel what I'm saying? They're not. He doesn't give them that same effect. Because he doesn't give them any type of feeling. He doesn't, real life funny doesn't give anybody, when you meet him or see him, he doesn't give you no feeling that touches your heart. He don't put you in your, he don't give you no type of connection of anything. So what type of experience is that? You feel what I'm saying? So they mad that when people hear my voice, they can connect and understand what I'm saying. And for him to try to get you to understand what he's saying, he got to go say, Hey, y'all come down to Cluckley's Mark Market and come buy these stuff and and whole store full of just just genetically modified products. He's recommending you to go to a store that has nothing but genetically modified chips and juices. Yes, y'all come down here because they paid me to tell you to come eat this genetically modified stuff. So I don't care about your health enough. Just do it. They paid me. I'm trying to get views now. That's what type talk here. <laughs> That's what type time this dude is on. You feel, he wants you to support whatever. They want you to support whatever. But that's what I'm here for, to tell you to keep your head on straight. Don't let people who have evil intentions. When I say evil intentions, I mean selfish intentions. He doesn't care about educating you or or giving you the real. He doesn't he doesn't care about any of that. He cares about the view. And that's it. You feel what I'm saying? So if a donkey wants to poop on him, he's going to let a donkey poop on him if that guarantees him some views. You feel what I'm saying? We're not going to get into that over here because it's not that serious. You feel what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, though, you can't please everybody and he going to need to get that through his head because he, he feels like the black community is just against him. But at, in all actuality, the black community just don't know you. I never I just first found out about you this year. And a lot of people I talked to about say you've been a nobody your whole life. So we have two different stories. My story is completely different from yours because I really went through it and they've already seen me over and over and over get through these obstacles. They've never seen you get through the obstacle, but you want them to support something. They don't even know your story. They don't even know what type of guy you are. You feel what I'm saying? 
you probably can't even hold a lie for 30 minutes because they'll realize your educational level ain't there. You claim you graduated from an HBCU. Well, go talk on the camera and let them see your educational level. Because from your jokes, your educational level do not look like you graduated no HBCU. It looked like you never even went to college the way you make your jokes. You feel what I'm saying? Because if you graduated, put where's the thought? <laughs> you feel what I'm saying? But with that being said, I'm going to end with this. He said he not going to make, uh, not he said, but they said uh, his content ain't geared towards black people because he, he trying to get the support from the white people or whatever. But if you know the most famous people that make reels, they target the black audience. AKA Desi Banks, one of the number he, top three at least when it comes to skits, he's killing it. And every skit that he gets his most views on are relative to how he grew up or the black neighborhood. It doesn't mean he's racist. That doesn't mean anything. But it means that he's showing love back to his people by making us laugh at things that we really had to go through that wasn't even all that funny, honestly. But we live through it. He's not giving you anything to connect to. He wants to go down to the water, to the um, to the golf place with the white people and take a picture watching the eclipse and say, this is the best moment of my life. Yes, I'm standing next to this man that uh, said he was going to help me um, with some restaurants, get some. This is the best day of my life. Why does not go? You can even go on his page. If I go on his page right now, you ain't going to find too many pictures hand wrapped around a black motherfucker saying I made it. You feel what I'm saying? He don't feel like when his hand wrapped around y'all, he made it. But when he when his hand wrapped around them, he feels like the best man in the world because this is the matrix. That's matrix happiness. I have natural happiness, something that can't be you can't compete with it because how they look at me and look at you are not the same. So why compete with me? You feel what I'm saying? He could have stood next to me, but if he stood next to me, then I may stand over him. And he doesn't want that to happen, just like many people. That's why you see people, they don't, if they was to try to support me and be next to me, they're, that's going to be good for them. But if they trying to do a podcast or something, they feel like, well, he might dim my light down because he already got his shit going on. They're going to pay attention to him more. So you don't see them sharing it. So you can't complain about me because I ain't complaining about you. Whether you share me or not, I'm going I'm to always go up. I have my own, you know what I'm saying? Like, it, it does not matter. Literally, I, I don't have to pay anybody for anything because if I want promotion, I can do it myself. If I want to do something, I can do it myself. If somebody shares my stuff or not, I appreciate it. But if you don't, I, I ain't going to be mad at you because, hey, man, they're against me because they're not sharing or he's not being supportive. He's trying to tear the community down because he doesn't think I'm funny. What type of person grown man tells other people that? Another grown man is trying to tear their community down just because they think you're corny. It's no coincidence that Kid Lono and Gully TV both think that he's corny. It's not a coincidence. Me and Jamil haven't talked on the phone and said, hey, you think he corny? You we've never talked on the phone one time. I, the only the only type of even encounter me and Jamil ever had, honestly, was uh, on social media. He tried to have somebody reach out to me. I believe he tried to talk to me on the phone. He had somebody send me a message, but I never even gave him a call. I don't know why, but I never gave him a call. I think he wanted to interview me about uh, that shooting or whatever that happened. That's what I believe, but I don't know for sure if that's what he wanted. But besides that, I'm never even, you know what I'm saying? So there's no biasness towards you. You're just not funny. You feel what I'm saying? And if you guys even want to know to go more further in detail, Real Life Funny has only went down since his viral video. Since he made that video, he has never had a video get that same numbers again. Again. He tried to, and, and, and then he, he, he has no content left that he keeps trying to do part two, part three, part four, part five. He's trying to drag out something that's not even trending anymore. That's how much he doesn't have content. Excuse me. He can't think of something good to make a skit out of so we trying to drag this thing along guess what y'all can go look at the numbers man i don't got a cap on people name his numbers ain't the same he made part two part three they don't even do 50 percent of what his first video did so is he going up or going down he got to a level he couldn't sustain and went like this do 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 it didn't even last for a month you feel what i'm saying
So keep the little reward that you got, which is the little promo from the people in the area and see how long that lasts. Because you're going to have to stretch that because you still ain't made it OT for anything. Not your viewers, not anything. The only thing that an OT motherfucker ever view you for is a real, which an OT person, everybody real, a, a out of town person sees. Anybody can see it. You get thousands of views and minutes, hours, whatever. An out of town person will see it. So again, he hasn't reached nowhere. But once you get there, I support you. I still support you now. You just got to get out your feelings and you got to realize I ain't your enemy. You know what I'm saying? But you kind of making me want to take your spotlight. And I could easily do that. But I want to be nice to you, man. You had that. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to let you be in the same lane as Dre Jenkins. And and uh, 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 I forgot to do who doing it right now or whatever. But that's y'all lane. You know what I'm saying? If I come stepping in y'all lane, then it's not going to be fun. I'm trying to just stay in my own thing. I'm already winning in my own lane. So let me do that. But with that being said, uh, I will be live again uh, tomorrow, y'all. I'm going to be up tonight for a while working on video so expect to be flooded um if y'all haven't seen me talk about certain topics that's because it's getting its own video so do not ever think that yeah you're not gonna watch i'm gonna see it might be a week or two after whatever happened y'all gonna still see that topic come out they're gonna think oh he ain't and bow i'm gonna drop it on y'all but i appreciate y'all for tapping in man uh hold on i ain't even been reading y'all comments or nothing i'm tweaking somebody said motherfuckers better off running marketing and ad campaigns to get the numbers for real. One one legacy. Facts. If I drop a video and I want an option of promoting it, I'm going to contact an influencer, all right, to pay them to post me, or I'm going to pay for an ad. But the fact that his views dropped mean he went to one of them scammy type joints. And you feel what I'm saying? Trying to be cheap as hell. Um, so when he said ads clone could have put them way higher. I'm tuned in, shake my head. Self hate. Now I wanted to know about the stream yard app. Um no, I wanted to know about the stream yard app. Uh oh, oh, oh. The stream yard app. Oh, oh, oh. Damn, I thought you knew about that. Uh listen, man. Um uh, how can I put it? All you gotta do is uh you ain't never wrote me before. I don't think I wrote you before, but I don't think you wrote me before, man. But uh, I send I I send you my number. I send you a DM. You know we can chat it up. You feel what I'm saying? But uh, yeah, man. I think that um, real life funny got an issue with us, man. He got an issue with us not agreeing with him. But at the end of the day, he doesn't represent our people. Like they gonna look at me and you that come from that place. You feel what I'm saying? But yeah, man. Uh, my peoples in them had told me or some uh to call you, man. But I just be procrastinating on. Man, I could tell you so many people that say I never called, but uh, yeah, man, I'm a DM you or send you my number, man. We could definitely chat it up, man, because uh, the city needs saving right now. Well, you already been doing your thing for a long time and shit, but uh, after I came, a lot of other people tried to came, but they can't do this. You know what I'm saying? Everybody can't talk about other people and go at it. You know what I'm saying? Like the shit you dealt with, the shit I dealt with. If you speak on certain shit, people gonna have an issue with that. You know what I'm saying? Not not everybody, but somebody might. And shit, you know what come with that? Shit, clout gonna come with that. More views gonna come with that. And you might have, you might bump in a motherfucker somewhere. You might, you know what I'm saying? That's what come with this social media stuff. You know what I'm saying? But with that being said, yo, y'all got any questions? Um, I will be, I'm gonna try to push these lives more. So I will be live tomorrow. Um, and just expect them videos, man. I'm talking about mad videos, like. Oh, I'm catching everything and I'm just throwing it into the file. I'm going to make sure I drop it on y'all. Expect more celebrity news as well. I try to make sure I get the eerie news out for y'all, but you're going to get a long wave of celebrity news too. But I'm just trying to balance everything out. But any questions from anybody before I hop off? I'm going to get y'all outro song and then uh, see y'all next time. Never met one like me, that was no surprise. Was no surprise. Heard you moving sideways, let me get you in line. Mm -hmm. I ain't trying to steal your heart, I'm not your, I'm not your valentine. The way I come with all these gifts, you think it's Christmas time. Whole world full of 
the same. Uh-huh. Shit get wicked sometimes. Yeah. You want a flying piece, it costs you a ticket sometimes. Yeah. When I speak, it's quiet. Yeah. You hear crickets sometimes. <laughs> if you learn from my mistakes, then you listen next time. Yeah. She know I'm top tier. She know not to talk when the cops here. She, the she cops know I miss her more when she not here. She not here. I talk to God a lot and keep my thoughts they clear. Keep my a lot of niggas switched up on me, guess it's life. I guess it's I life. my brother was my enemy in plain sight. In plain I dream sight. at night, but in the daytime, we live in life. Daytime. Live in the moment, cause we'll never get to night twice. I, will never get I can't it. sell my soul, a soul can't pay the right can't price. The right Don't price. turn your back on me and make my shoulder cold as ice. Cold you as know ice. I never mean you wrong, I always treat you I right. Treat you Hopped right. in the streets early, made it home every night. Home every Be scared night. to fly sometimes, pray to God for safe flights. Same New you since Toy Story, was close like Woody and Buzz like. Mm-hmm. I put my life inside a book, I got my paper right. Got my paper right. If it's love, it's off the strip, it ain't no favor it right. Ain't no favors right. Yeah. She ain't never met one like me, that was no surprise. That was no surprise. Heard you moving sideways, let me get you in line. Mm-hmm. I ain't trying to steal your heart, I'm not your valentine. I'm not your valentine. The way I come with all these gifts, you think it's Christmas yeah, time. It's Whole cynical. world full of sin, mm-hmm. shit get wicked sometimes. Yeah. You want a flying piece, it costs you a ticket sometimes. Yeah. When I speak, it's quiet, yeah. you hear crickets sometimes. Hear crickets sometimes. Yeah. If you learn from my mistakes, then you listen next time. Yeah. Long live old me.